When an elected official, city or county employee gets suspended or put on vacation, everyone is asking the same question, and that is why. And that's a question that's been asked this week after the suspension and probation of Starkville Police Chief Frank Nichols. Why or what did he do were common comments under the story on the WCBI Facebook page. And we want to answer your questions. Our Joy Talley joins us live to tell us why details often aren't released on personnel matters. A personnel matter doesn't matter if someone works for a city, taxpayers, or for a bank. It's all between management, the employee, and not the public. Letting the public know there was a personnel matter surrounding someone isn't against the law. The legislature was fairly clear in the Public Meeting Act, Open Meetings Act, and the Public Records Act that personnel files are exempt from public disclosure and that a board, a public board, considering a personnel matter involving job performance can do that in private session or executive session. When a city or county employee is reprimanded or suspended, the public often wants to know why. But whether your tax dollars are going towards someone's salary or not, Columbus attorney Jeff Turnage says it's still a private matter. They're going into executive session to discuss an item of personnel related to job performance of a particular person in a particular department and they they won't name the name or or say what the conduct was but at least the public will know um, generally they're talking about a disciplinary matter of a particular person in, in a certain department. Turnage says details stay private to protect everyone involved. The employer would take risks by discussing matters of personnel because the employee has rights and so there's several causes of action the employee might bring against the employer for leaking out um, private matters. At the end of the day, regardless of the situation, law says the public doesn't have a right to know. The ultimate goal is to protect personal um, restricted information, not so much so um, the misdeed or the action, but protect the individual. Turnage says many things are exempt in the Public Records Act, including investigative files of a police department. Reporting live here in Columbus, Jory Talley, WCBI News.